What is up, guys? Wraith here, Greybeard Gaming Society. We are back on our little buddy Riordan. We have, uh, as discussed in the last episode, we went ahead and knocked out level 10. We went and trained up. So we now have, uh, well, as we planned, we put, uh, put the one point that we had into Tiger Claw. So we can Tiger Claw stuff. And then we put the rest into Mend. So our Mend is about halfway there from what I've been told from uh, other monkeys. As far as being uh, maybe reliable where we can actually use it. We also swung by the bank and dropped off. Actually, get rid of that. We dropped by, dropped off that uh, piece of chitin that we had because it was big and heavy. Okay, well, let's find something. Run out here. And... Tiger Claw! I don't know. I still think the kick might look a little cooler. But whatever. Is that just... Yeah, it's water. We'll take it. But so yeah. So now we're going to say we're level 10. We got Tiger Claw. We did the mend. Let's, yep, nothing at all. All right, better than blowing up, I guess. But we are going to make our way back out into the common lands. And we are going to uh, throw up the LFG and see what we can do about getting an orc group going on. So I think actually we'll probably uh, head across to the tunnel first. It's probably be safer to hang out there. Well, we, of course, we might just run around and hunt bears while we... Tiger claw things in the back! But we uh, might, yeah, <laughs> keep getting distracted. Gotta, Tiger Claw! But yeah, we're going to uh, throw up LFG here. And then, uh, let's see. Alright, so we've uh, got the LFG up. We've called out to see if anybody can use us. I think in the interim, we're going to run around and hunt some bears, see if we can make us a little bit of cash and uh stick around we'll see if we can't uh see if we can't get something rolling here guys see if we can't get that last piece for our sash Well, gang, that's not exactly how we planned for it to go down, to be quite honest with you. We, uh, we've we shouted out a handful of times trying to get a group, haven't had any kind of responses at all. Uh, we had one other person run by, like an LFG tag, but we, uh, we actually ran up to one of the orc camps just to check, and somebody apparently had gone through and cleared it out, and we, were, we picked off the strays kind of one of the times they popped up, and sure enough, we got ourselves... A death fish, a death fist slashed belt, which is the last thing that we need to go do our turn in to get our next part of our sash quest done. Now we also took quite a beating because <laughs> on the last one that we fought, we uh, caught a lion immediately behind that who kind of jumped, or the lioness I should say, who jumped us immediately uh, afterwards. So we got lucky that we got out of there with that one. And we have uh, zero buffs now, so we're running in slow motion. We're going to cruise by the tunnel. And see if we can pick up some uh, some fast feet right after we tiger claw this bear in the butt. We're going to see if we can uh, get some buffs, run to town, turn in uh, turn in for our little sash quest here. So we'll check back in here in just a second when we're getting uh, closer. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. We did get one high quality bear skin. So we'll see. Uh, we need to see if we can get that sold at the same time. So uh, let's see if we can get a quick sale on that and make a little bit of plat. And then... Get uh, some buffs and take off to town and get some things handed in. And we will be right back. I will uh, skip the selling part and we'll check back in as we're arriving back near the uh, near the guild hall. Alright gang, as you can see we are here in front of Velen Taresk, the guy for our second belt. You can also see we weren't able to get any buffs so it took a little bit longer running than I wanted. But we were able to sell our high quality bear skin for like 20 plat really quickly. So... Made a little bit of plat, came to town, slowly, <laughs> ran to North Report, got the chest piece back, because again, it's kind of heavy, so it should be one, two, 
three. Here's the original white's training sash. And bam! Now we have our yellow training sash, which, again, it's not gangbusters compared to some of the stuff we have, but it's still cool. It's stats all the way around at zero weight. We will take it, plus we have completed yet another monkey quest, which is quite spiffy. The other thing we need to do while we're here this time around, however, is we are completely out of bandages, which so far, it seems to be where we're spending the bigger portion of what income we have is uh, on the bandages to keep ourselves in tip-top shape. However, they are worth every penny. Got my bind wound skill, I think, higher on this character than we've had on any other character so far in the challenge because we just bind wound a lot. But we are pretty much all set in the adventuring department. We have still have plenty of food, still have plenty of water. We have a little stowing kit. We've managed to make like eight silk swatches once we get a decent amount of those we'll probably just see if we can sell them because i don't really think we're going to go for trade skills per se um to see if we can't make some cash we still have i mean a fair amount of ammo i don't want to overdo it on the ammo because i don't want to weigh myself down too much with uh, just that maybe we'll grab a couple more i think it's like this person here uh let's see i think right now we got the shurikens I'm trying to remember the range of that was like 120 Range that was 45. Range of this one was 60. These actually, the axes, I think, actually have like the best range. I think so. I'll tell you what, let's. How much? Oh, that's the thing, right? You only get the one. Yeah. All right. That sucks. That sucks. So we're going to stick with these. We're going to stick with these because we want stacks of things. And we will just fling little ninja stars at whatever. We'll sell that back, take a slight loss in profit kind of messed up our stuff a little bit but that's okay we will we will survive but so now we have a full refill on ammo we've been trying to remember to uh to launch our throwing stars at stuff as we can just to keep the skill going but that will definitely help us out some and i think we're in a pretty good spot to set out and try to do a bit more adventuring we're still underweight if i'm not mistaken i believe according to the spiffy chart that i found our, our weight to AC range at this size is we can carry just shy of like 15. So we're actually still in pretty good shape. Quite honestly, we could probably uh, drop off some of the plat, but I find it just handy to have, have it and it gives us room to hold on to just stuff that might be worth a little bit of money. So we will roll with that. We will roll outside. We'll uh, put the LFG back up, see if we can't get a group going and see what we can find out, guys. So stick around. Let's, uh, let's go find some adventures. Well, so with LFG for, for quite a little while, we've actually ground out, you know, we're 25-ish, we're 25, -ish, uh, 25 to 30 percent to level. We just kind of kept walking down the dunes. Um, no no bites on the group. We tried to LFG a couple times, like out of character, see if there was any uh, orc groups or anything. No love there. So, uh, aha, I'm in. Finally worked. <laughs> Yay. But basically, we, we ended up at the door to Befallen. So, um, you know, maybe... Uh, Maybe we mess around in here for a little bit and see how, I mean, obviously we'll have to be super careful. At the moment, we're a little on the upswing because we have a Spirit of the Wolf, so if things go bad, which is the only reason I kind of got as brave as it, plus we're really close to the door right now. But this guy is probably going to outdo us here because he is getting some really good hits in. So yeah, let's, um, let's just go ahead and not risk this. We're even with him, but I don't want to risk it. We might go into that fight with uh, with a full full health bar, and actually, I mean, most likely, honestly, it's um. Okay, that 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 was a pucker. <laughs> that was a full pucker. Thankfully, he doesn't seem to mind me, so I'll take it. Um, you know, but maybe maybe we pick up here next time. Maybe this will just be a good spot to pick up next time and just do this one a little short. And maybe next time we um. We just pick up trying to do some some hunting around the door on the top floor around Befallen, maybe, and see how our little monkey can do. I mean, obviously, again, we'll have to be careful. We don't have Fang Death or anything yet. But at the same time, you know, if we're careful, or maybe we run back and actually get some buffs and, and, you know, play, again, you know, safe. You know, I do know there used to be a pretty good experience mod in there. Might be able to shoot us through the levels. Because really, I think, you know, once we get to, to Fang Death, um, you know, a lot of our fortunes will change, so to speak. At least on how brave we are. Granted, there'll be there'll be a lot of random flopping just to raise that skill up. But um, you know, we'll just we'll just kind of have to see see how it goes. I mean, I think that might be a pretty good idea. 
is um, we will get all rested up and regined up, and we will uh, we'll pick up here next time and see you know how we do handling the the top floor befallen with a full health bar. And, uh, you know, we'll go from there and see how we, maybe we get lucky and get a group or something. You never know. I mean, again, it's just, it's been kind of a slow day. I haven't gotten much going on today. Uh, I guess slightly off hours for most people yet. It's, it's not really prime time. It's just the time that I had to play. So, you know, we, we'll, we'll go from here. But as always, guys, if you do like what we're doing, hey, don't forget to like, comment, maybe subscribe down below. We do love to hear from everybody. It doesn't matter which character we're on. If you see us, go ahead and chat us up. We will chat you back. But until next time, guys, stay safe, stay distant, stay in EverQuest, and we'll catch you guys next time.